All right, so welcome back to Garden Warfare 2. Welcome back to another episode of The Best. We have not got long left to go now. We've got like, what, three episodes left? This is gonna be my favorite part of the series because now we get to play my three favorite classes. So today we're looking at the Citron and you can already see who I've picked. You can see who I've chosen. Yeah, pretty obvious pick in my eyes. I've never really shifted from Iron Citron. I mean, apart from the one time that Electro was the best. <laughs> long time ago. Also do me a favor if you enjoy the video or you just wanna help support the channel. Maybe think about hitting that like button. You backhand it, fly kick it if you want. So why is Iron the best Citron in Garden Warfare 2? It's a bit like trying to explain why water is wet or why Wolfie plays as a legend. And they put me on the wrong team. Well, am I allowed to switch or am I going to have to suffer an entire round of Great White North on the wrong side? I was right, the game's about to end anyway. Don't get me wrong, he's far from the perfect character. I mean, there's no such thing. A lot of it just comes down to how Citron is kind of built as a class. He's a hit and run class. It didn't used to be that way. He used to sort of be multi-purpose depending on which variant you pick. You still have variants like Iron and Party who were hit and run characters, but then you had the likes of Electron and Electron, Electro and Toxic, who were basically just yeah sit in the back never fight anyone pick everyone off from a distance type thing and then popcap pretty much decided that they wanted all citrons to be hit and run so that's when they did the rework which was fine for variants like reg and party iron didn't really feel any different for me i know they cut down his damage at range a little bit but honestly his damage at range was pretty shit in the first place so oh no he did 25 damage across the map and now he only does like 18 oh no imagine my disgust for me with the rework variants like reg and party just got even better than they already were and then variants like toxic and electric became, yeah, how'd you say, dog shit. Ducky McDucky 98. Love it. Also, as you can see, I finally brought back the dragon skin. All right, nice. First kill of the whole game. Let's get it. Oh, shit. I got you. Hey, you might have been one kill away from party time. Jesus Christ, my aim sucks. Thank you. Yeah, haven't played this guy in a hot minute. A little bit rusty. This is a very much a character that is good depending on how on point your shot is. As you can see, mine isn't especially, but we're getting by. Oh, Toxic. Great, my favorite. Yeah, I'm just going to back up. Hold on. Or not. <sighs> yeah, do you know what? We're not talking about it. My fault, right? I pussied out. I could have just shot his toenail and he was dead. So Citron is very much just built for hit and run. You ball in, you come out the ball, you kill them, you go back in the ball, you piss off. And Iron is especially good at this. He has only got one shot in the clip, and my biggest criticism of him would be his kind of lack of DPS. Oh, we got iron. Oh, we take those. No, don't stand in the stink cloud, you dingus. Hi, what's up? Uh, I definitely hit you twice. Oh, they've already taken it. Well, they are not playing around with this one. They want this game over real quick. And honestly thanks because i'm so sick and tired of getting this map every single time i go on mix mode it is a fucking constant yeah iron lacks a little bit in the dps department which means if you come across multiple zombies he's not the best but then again i'd argue that there aren't really any citrons who especially excel in that department i mean reg party and frozen have pretty good dps but realistically he's a big target if you come across multiple zombies someone's gonna kill you Nice. That was a good kill. Happy with that. I won't lie to you. For me, my favorite thing about Iron is definitely how accurate he is. So if your shot's on point, then this guy's one of the most consistent characters you ever use. As long as the dude you're trying to shoot isn't more than like mid-range, you're hitting 50. And with two reload upgrades, you're laughing. Oh, we got it. Damn it. Well, that was fun for the second and a half that it lasted. I don't think I've ever seen a team this dedicated to the objective. I'm actually impressed. So for me, Iron has just always been such a solid character. Easily, like, top five, I think. Dr. Ooga Booga. But between that and biannual note, yeah, game of tag game's on point today. He's a solid character. Hits consistent damage. His legendary mode is disgusting. And he's the second bulkiest character in the whole game. So uh, have fun trying to kill him. Zenelm has been armed. I didn't even realize we are playing Gnome Bomb. I think I can call that a successful defense. Single-handedly stop that. I got it. Go on then, let's get this iron mode. Oh, oh he got far. <laughs> Where the fuck do you think you're going? Oh, he had like six health left. Quick maths. Bro, I can't get a kill. I didn't mean to use that. 
There you go. About time. Thank you. It's ass kicking time. Seriously? That's how you had to do it. Oh, come on, the shot's actually on point right now. Oh, cool, I can actually just get up there. You see why you don't use this guy at long range? Oh my god, it's painful. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's armed. Quick, quick, quick. And they defused it. Well, that was not ideal. That's payback. Easy, Tiger. Fucking hell. There's the iron. Yeah, I think I'm spent. Shame, I could have done more with that. Kind of wasted it. Thank you. That was in my face. I, why would you even try that? Yeah, let's just walk straight past the Iron Citron and pretend he doesn't exist. Foolproof plan, my guy. That's it. I love how these two had exactly the same idea. Did the jump and everything. You know what they say? Dragon skins think alike. Fucking hell, okay, calm down. Casual quad beam bomb, as you do. Oh, wow, like that wasn't the most obvious shit in the world. You tried. Yeah, he's been targeting me for like the whole game. Good thing he's dog shit. Dude, I can't see anything! Yeah, that was a bit better. Seven kills. Holy shit. How long was that kill streak? Sudden death overtime. Great. Although I swear in gnome bomb sudden death, all we have to do is plant it. Mate, I could do that. Or I could just bait them. Or I could just go fuck myself. Jesus H Christ. I think that's my best kill streak with this character. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta check this. Is that actually my best kill streak with him? Oh my god, it was. I'm glad I got that on camera. Anyway, that's going to be it from me. So if you enjoyed the video, then make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new around here. Turn on the notification bell end. And thanks as always for watching. Have a good one. And I'll see you next time.